Jaya. Jaya. Hello. Beautiful people. We are back here with this gorgeous goddess, galactic goddess. I don't know what the difference is between galactic goddess and just goddess. What is it? Yeah, do you feel like you're galactic? I think you feel like I'm galactic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, completely galactic. <laughs> <laughs> completely galactic. Completely galactic. You're from another planet. Yeah. I know, but so are you. <laughs> so, um, yeah, the topic for this video we were thinking about is how to create resonance in mm. relationships. Um, yeah, it's a good one. It's a really because, good one. Yeah. What comes to mind when, when, when we say how to create resonance in relationships? Well, what I was just feeling right now is how it, that we're rocking, the way we're rocking. I was, I was already starting to feel like really resonant with you, but um, more than that. So we're just like moving in the same rhythm right now, which there's something that feels really sweet and in resonance. But I think more on a um, really practical and also spiritual in, in that sense what creates resonance in our relationship? Well, the first thing that comes to mind is I have to be in resonance with myself. Oh, yes. <laughs> I have to be in resonance yeah. with myself to be in resonance with you. So being in resonance with myself, for me, the way I feel about that, it's about um, being at one or okay with what is and being in the present moment. So being present with what is and not fighting against what is. So if I'm not fighting against what is in myself, and if I'm not fighting against what is in you, mm. then there's a level of resonance there. It's just like, this is okay. Yeah. And it's not about it feeling good or bad necessarily. It's just, I'm in acceptance. Mm, that's beautiful. I love that. Yeah. I can feel a big difference when you are in resonance with yourself and when you are not. Mm -hmm. you no, know, you were talking about needing downtime. You know, for instance, if we have been spending like half a day together and then suddenly there is a drop of energy and you mm -hmm. go like, okay, right now I need I need to go back to myself a little. Yeah. It's very healthy to retreat and then go back to your space, come back, and then we are back into into resonance together. So I really recognize that. Yeah. 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 For me, I, and I don't know if the same is true for you, but for me, definitely. I need to go into my own space to, or um, it really helps for me to go into my own space to get back into resonance. And especially if I've been social a lot or been out and extroverted energy, like I really need what I call downtime, like just going back and being with myself, being quiet, mm -hmm. being still. And when I do that, I go right back into resonance and then I'm rejuvenated and I'm ready for more connection. Yeah. I feel I feel actually exactly the same, you know. You do, you it's do. like yeah, when uh, you know I take off, I go into the river, I go back into mm. my practices. It's a bit the equivalent, even though I don't go into stillness, I go into something which is more dynamic, mm -hmm. but a way to reconnect with myself. And if I have extended periods of time where I cannot do that, then I have to find ways of regenerating within the context of our dynamics. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it's, it can be challenging as well. Mm -hmm. So yeah, no, it's very good. Mm -hmm. What uh, what strikes me in the in the word resonance is that there is the word so sound. You know, it's, mm, it comes from a wave, so yeah. it's like entering into the same wave. And sound is energy, right? So mm. when we're in resonance, it really means yes. that on an energetic level, we are we're vibrating like, together. Ooh, we're in the same <laughs> in the space, same right? In, and when we're in dissonance, we're like fighting against, we're taking stands in two different spaces, and yeah. we're saying like, no, my, we're basically energetically saying like, my stand, my yeah. stand is right. And yeah. it's like, Exactly. Yeah, forcing exactly. against each other. And uh, when you talk about my space, you know what I see is a is a spiritual space. It's an energetic space. So it's mm -hmm. like if you are if we are in the same energy reality. For instance, if we have been doing practices together, mm -hmm. or if we have been going into a, a journey together, then we are going to be in resonance because mm -hmm. we are in the same spirit. We are bathing in the same energy. Mm -hmm. If you are doing your own thing and I'm doing my own thing, and then we try to meet and connect, sometimes we are going to be in dissonance because mm -hmm. you are in a different spirit. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like literally a different agenda. If if I go like, wow, I want to go to the beach, and you want to go into the mountain, mm -hmm. you know, it's just going to be 
be a different different spirit and a different resonance. Yeah. And so I feel that very strongly. You know, when when we are in resonance, it really means that we are we are vibrating with the same way, with the right. same spirit. Right. Right. Yeah. I don't know if that if I feel exactly that way. Mm -hmm. I feel like it has a. I feel like we can have two different. We can go be in our own spaces and come back together and mm -hmm. still be in resonance. Of course. Yeah. But yeah. 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 Totally. Yeah. But yeah. I think I know what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we come back maybe uh, tell you how to enter into resonance in another video. Another video? <laughs> yeah, we're at five minutes now. You know, I'm sweet, so I have to. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we love you. Bye. <laughs>